The fact that you have a herniated disc is important to know, but it does not mean that that's why you are in pain. All right, so I'll kind of run you through our approach here and then I'll uh, tie it in with, with your low back. So we are an integrative clinic where we use interventional orthobiologics. So that's the PRP injections, that's the bone marrow or the adipose, which some people will call uh, stem cell procedures. We use those to help patients who are suffering chronic pain in conjunction with other approaches such as nutrition, lifestyle, supplements, peptides, medications, everything else that you know constitutes medicine to help you to respond better to our injection therapies and to also help with your overall health, which is going to help with your overall ability to heal and have less pain. Because of that, we do not work with insurance because insurance deems most of this stuff experimental, despite a significant amount of research actually supporting the use of almost everything that we do. But insurance is behind on the times and they don't like to pay for stuff that they, um, that's, you know, is, is going to help in this capacity. So, um, so we don't work with insurance. In your case, the the biggest thing for me is seeing you in person and doing a physical assessment in order to better understand why you are having this back pain. Yes, you have an MRI that shows a herniated disc and your pain may be coming from that herniated disc, but it may not be. So we can have people who have, I have a herniated disc uh, currently and an MRI in both my neck and my back and I currently have no neck pain and I maybe get back pain that's a one out of 10, one day a month. So, but you can have other people who have a herniated disc and who have very, very bad pain that is from their herniated disc. And you can have some people who have excruciating back pain and they have no herniated disc. So the fact that you have a herniated disc is important to know, but it does not mean that that's why you are in pain. And so our physical assessment, which lasts about 30 to 45 minutes, depending on the person, uh, is how we will get an idea of what I think is causing that pain. From there, we also then take a, a bigger picture look at your health. So we run some labs, we do some other diagnostic stuff in order to get a sense of internally, how are things, how are the gears moving, how's the engine working, and where are some areas that we could focus on in order to help optimize you to heal not just with the injections, but just as a human, you know, how can we help you to heal better?